The 95th Annual Future Farmers of America Convention is in town for the week with numerous events and breakout sessions for students from across the state. But for one day, those students got an opportunity to step out in the community for a day of service. ABC 31 News reporter Brandon Brown tells us more. The Food Bank of Central Louisiana is a helping hand to many food insecure people in Sinlaw, but today it was the Food Bank that received an extra helping hand. We've had them come for sev several years as part of the convention. They do a day of service and we take a big group of students from, again, across the state. It's a way for them to give back as part of their convention. Um, today, we, happen we just happen to have a bunch of produce that needs to be bagged, which kind of works well for a group of FFA students. But they're here bagging potatoes and um, tomatoes and getting things ready to go out to the families that we serve here every day. This year's Future Farmers of America's annual state convention brought chapters from all across the boot to Alexandria's own Randolph Riverfront Center. But for one day of the week, FFA members get a chance to get together and volunteer in the community. FFA is self-described as an intracurricular student organization for those interested in agriculture and leadership. Nathaniel Underwood says the service day demonstrates just how FFA exemplifies that leadership. You really see how big the organization is and how impactful it is in Louisiana in general, but also in the smaller economies. And it's, it's really just, it just puts in perspective for you how, how diverse but how together we are. Consider that impact of community service a job well done as well. FFA students bag just under 16 and a half thousand pounds worth of produce for the people of central Louisiana. And it just makes sense that the future farmers of America are the hands that put together the bags of produce that will help feed so many families because some of them may be the literal future farmers that grow those same important foods. It's kind of nice to know that you're able to do stuff. And like you said, it's going through my hands so that I know that somewhere along the way, if somebody's eating a meal, I had a part in that. And that's just really nice to know, you know, because I love helping people. That's one of the things that brings me the most joy. Brandon Brown, ABC 31 News, that works for you.